Hey folks, it's Bishop Eels from the ECF Forums and host for Vink TV Live, baby. I'm here today because, man, let me tell you, Amo Makani, he is the fucking man, I gotta say. He fucking sent me a brass, Nemi. Check this out. Isn't this a lovely brass, Nemi? Woohoo! And we thought it couldn't get even any better, let me tell you. Mm. This is his stainless steel Nemi. And between the difference between the two is really nothing much except this right here. See that? On the stainless steel, there's no logo. You don't have his lovely logo of the steam. And here it is. See that? There's his logo of the steam engine. Forget about it. Let me tell you. This thing has been hitting nice and hard. That's for sure. Mmm. I cleaned it out, I polished it, I used Mother's Metal Polish on this bullet, buffed it, it's beautiful, mirror finish, oh my gosh man, let me tell you, let me uh, see if I can zoom this in for you, it's so freaking gorgeous, you know, it's a shame, like I really don't want to take this out, I very rarely do, because it's beautiful, it's a beautiful, beautiful mod. There's my serial number 0054. Beautiful, beautiful. Lock ring, you can even barely see it. It's all like mirror shine on my Ithaca. Ooh, only if my Ithaca was like gold. Mmm. Oh, it'll look freaking kicking, banging. Forget about it. Oh my gosh. Now, one thing I have to say that um, as some of you know, I was at Honest Vapor over the weekend. And um, I did have my brass Nemi with me. I did. Though I didn't get to vape on it. Didn't get to vape on it. Tell you why. Because Dino was in the house, and Dino and I, we had a discussion. We were talking about silver contacts. And, you know, I, I told him, I said, Nemesis has silver contacts. And he's aware of that. And, you know, he said, you know what? It could be probably plated. And I was like, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Hmm, could it? So some, some of the customers there also said, yeah, it could be plated. So I was like, you know, I wouldn't doubt that. But you know what? Being that I had extra contacts, I had extra contacts at home, I said, let's cut it and let's find out. You know, literally. And that's what we did. We ended up cutting the 510 portion of... The Nemesis Contact. And I'm going to show you that it is pure, pure silver. Check it out. So thanks to Dino. Dino did the honors. As you can see, he cut a whole piece from here. See, and there is no copper whatsoever. Nothing. No stainless steel plating. Nothing. It's all silver. Even here. Look at that. Unbelievable, huh? Unbelievable. And it's so and it's so fragile that it was so easy to cut. As a matter of fact, I'll even cut the other piece right now. Right in front of you. This is so fragile. So I'm gonna Here we go. I cut another piece, another layer, and let me focus that for you. Look at that. It's pure silver. Pure, pure silver. That's why they hit so freaking hard. I mean, there's nothing better than silver. I mean, the only thing is, it's not durable. As you can see, with a pair of pliers, I'm able to chip it, okay? So, it's, um, it's remarkable, remarkable. So you know, I had an extra five ten for the uh, for the cap, and that was uh, from this piece from the cap piece. That's what we were just slicing and cutting. Okay, so I had an extra one. 
thanks to Katerina, that's for sure. Thank you, honey. She's the one that, uh, on my brass, she actually sent me a few extra contacts. But I may actually put it in order for some more. <laughs> because I'm pretty sure a lot of people may want to see this up close and personal. So, mmm. And the same thing applies. You can use this as 18650 mode. That's on here now. You can use an 18350, 18490 mode, and with a kick. Um, it comes with an extra spring. The threads are so smooth. I mean, very, very, very smooth. I mean, and the wonderful thing about it is that it doesn't rattle. See? It doesn't rattle. You hear nothing? It doesn't rattle. That's like beautiful, I tell you. Nothing. Oh. And I have it on my Ithaca 009. And it looks beautiful with a mirror polish. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. I'm gonna. This is like one of my V prized possession right next to GGTS, let me tell you. It is a work of art, craftsmanship. It is just so elegant to look at. And it is just so, so beautiful. And if you have the silver, what's cool about it is that you can change parts. You know, you can change the, um, the switch, the cap, put them in stainless steel, or change or add the brass as far as on the switch and the cap on your stainless steel just to change the look of it. You know, kind of like the Chi Yu. But this thing is just so beautiful to look at. And it's so light, very, very, very light. Um, I did also receive his. Um, I also received his sixty nine, um, which I'll be doing a review on it at a later date. I'm still playing with it. Um, it's right here. It's uh, the brass version of the sixty nine, the new one. Okay, which I'm still playing with it, but I wanted to play with this for a while before I gave it a review, and it is just, I'm just in love with this device. I'm in total, total love with this device. The switch is very, very smooth, very short throw, very, very, very short. Threads are like butter. The cap, just like in the stainless steel, when you place your atomizer or cardo, this is an adjustable 510. So you adjust it with <coughs> your atomizer, rebuildable cardo, and then you insert it. And then tighten it up with the switch. Mm. really really good but um i wanted to also talk about <coughs> honest vapor we um i was at honest vapor over the weekend and we had such a great time over there it was a beautiful 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 time um i was there from one o'clock in the afternoon uh making coils <laughs> I mean, it was like non, non, non-stop. Um, here, let's see if I can uh, show you. Here's one of the customers that came in looking for a coil. Helped them out. Here's Lou. He actually, in this photo, um, if you can't tell, he actually grabbed my ass. <laughs> Not one, but my two cheeks. Forget about it. 
Oh man, his his two guys have been funny as hell. I was building their uh, their RBAs. Um, they actually came all the way down from Jersey, uh, almost like an hour and a half in traffic just to get down here, um, or if not two hours. Mr. Righteous over here in Outer Banks, they were waiting patiently. I had uh, so many people in line as far as for coils, but you know, after I hooked them up, they were really, really, really happy and pleased. There's Rob from Fluid Vapor. Um, you got Max over there. You got Karen. Um, they were also coming down, you know, to visit Lou and myself, you know, from coils, making coils and stuff. It, it is, it is a really, really good nook of people. Um, there's Dino, of course. He's he's not a fan of dual coils, and he's just letting himself know about that. That's for sure. Um, we we had we had a good turnout, a real, 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 real good turnout. That's for sure. You know, everyone had a good time, vaping our asses off, as you can see. And you know, that's what it's all about. I mean, it, it's it's about having fun, meeting local vapers. Um, people that share the same passion plus people that are looking for an alternative instead of smoking cigarettes I mean that's what this is all about you know and it's a very very close knit community and you know everyone's helping one another and that's all really what matters um, if if that wasn't the case I wouldn't even be here reviewing or even helping anyone as far as building their coils that's for sure um, that's what I really, you know, take pride in and enjoy in as far as re-engineering coils, showing people what they can do with the devices, maxing it out as far as for the vapor production, their taste. Oh, man, it's, it's, it's such an enjoyment feeling to help someone out. Um, I mean, it's, I, I've seen certain builds that, uh, PVs that needed to be recalibrated and they didn't know how to calibrate. I had to show them how to clean it, how to, you know, regrease them, recalibrate them, and, uh, build coils and RBAs and stuff and and that you know after after they take a vape on it It's well worth it. I mean you see the eyes jiggling and they're just totally totally pleased like it's like a whole new device all over again for them You know, so I'm, I'm really really happy to help them out with that that that's you know that that's really you know what what it's all about and that's what I'm here for you know and you know I'm looking forward to, to go down an honest vapor again, you know, we had a really really good turnout um, I'll be very, very happy to go down there again. If Lou wants me to go down there, I'll be more than happy and pleased. Um, as, uh, j oh, just for a heads up, this Saturday, I will be at Fluid Vapor. Yes, Rob's uh, Fluid Vapor. I'll be there from opening to close. So anybody that needs a hand with the rebuildables, come on down. Um, I'll be there. Um, so he'll have plenty of wire, wick. In stock rebuildables Jenny's um, he just got a whole new supply in so um, you know he was uh, telling me that there's some people that needed it to get installed and I said you know what I'll come down and I'll give a hand no problem so you know anyone in the New York area uh, come down to Bohemia New York I'm gonna be there this Saturday I'll leave the description and the address down on my YouTube description so um, you can contact Rob ahead of time and let him know if you know you're coming down and if you need a coil to be done. Um, so I can try to f fit you as best as possible because I, I do get a lot of people that come down and it's um, it, I want to make sure that everybody gets a coil done. Okay, so um, come on down. I'll give you an RBA class at the same time. I'll help you out with your Jennies as well as your uh, silk RBAs. It'll be totally, totally fun. It's a family atmosphere, you know, he has a surround sound system, theater, everything, the lounge is beautiful, gorgeous, so AC is pumping, so you ain't going to be sweating bullets, forget about it, you know, so uh, come on down, I'll be more than happy to see you, and all the previous people that came down, if you guys want to come down and see me again, I'll be there, that's for sure. Uh, I'll definitely bring my Ithaca and a few other toys and a few other things so we can actually play with. So with that, I'm going to let you guys go. Live hard, baby, and vape hard. Forget about it.